Buenos dias, good afternoon, good evening, wherever you are in the beautiful world, whenever you're watching this YouTube video, welcome to the Bitcoin Family YouTube channel, the channel where I say BAM every time again and again and again because I hold up my Bitcoin. I'm a happy dude living now in Mexico with some Bitcoins. Guys, today's charts are really cool. Bitcoin charts, maybe even looking into Ethereum a little bit, Litecoin a little bit, but also showing you two other really cool charts. Again, charts you haven't seen before and are showing you in which part of the Bitcoin cycle we are at the moment. I will keep it short, but powerful. Let's jump into the first chart. Bam! And that was the first band. Some coffee first, guys. Mm. Well, I'll drink my coffee. I increased the size of my face. <laughs> there we are. We are now on the four hour chart. Like you can see, this chart, we have looked at it many more times. And every time we say, okay, we come above this red line over there. There's a lot of lines. I'm going to delete them very soon. But we come above this red line, the 200 moving average. And then we need to go up retest it and then go up again but we broke down the first time that is what we see over there we went up we want to retest it but bam we broke down and here again we went up we want to retest it but bam we broke down so we didn't go up to this area and here again we broke up oh beautiful we retested we thought you we were going up and bam we broke down again that's a lot of yellow lines now on this chart. This is a strange pattern in my opinion. In Bitcoin, normally we should be breaking out when I see these um, breakouts above these lines, but we are seeing this huge resistance around the 60K level, like you can see here, this green line. There's a huge area of resistance. We need to start to break that resistance. If we don't break that resistance, yes, we could go even lower. I'm going to delete all these beautiful yellow stuff over here so that you see it a little bit better, guys. Because if we fall down, we could fall down around 50K again. I don't believe we fall down below 50K. And I'm going to tell you now why I don't believe that we will fall down below the 50K. In my opinion, where this happened and we are not finding support on this 200 level, we are going sideways. We are fighting around this 200 moving average and then mostly that means that we are sideways. You can see this in this chart. Bam! Oh no, first, yeah, this is the golden cross of course. And in this chart you can also see what is happening. We have this channel move going on over there. This is the 4 hour chart. This is the golden cross. Normally when we see the golden cross we explode. We did start to explode, but we are pulling back. Now, this green line needs to stay above the red line. If we go downwards crossing this red line, that's a bearish cross, a dead cross, which means we will go downwards a little bit more. If we like, you know, go like sideways a little bit and then up again, we still are bullish. But we are moving in this huge channel like you can see over here. We will come from here we went uh, let, let's draw we come from here we go to the top we go to the bottom we go to the top we go to the bottom we go to the yeah that's what i expect we go to the top and then we come again around 60k somewhere we will break that 60k or we go here break out of the channel and then you uh, create a complete new pattern but i don't believe that you can also see this on the weekly chart here bam on the weekly chart, when you zoom out, and we love to zoom out on this channel because you zoom out in Bitcoin and you zoom in at live. Um, but if you zoom out, this is every candle is a week. If you look at this one, this is the 21st of December 2020. That's a long time ago, guys. And you can see even on the weekly, we are moving in this channel. Yes, I, I believe we are moving in the weekly chart. Bam to there. Bam to the bottom. Bam to the top. Somewhere like that. That is what I believe that we are doing. So for me, all those daily movements are really nice to look at and to see what uh, the market is doing. 
but for my expectations guys we are just bottoming out on this channel over here and this is going becoming higher and higher you can see 53k already now and here it will be 55k and there will be a moment we will go to the top again and visit that channel at the top and that channel at the top at the moment i will extend it let's see for example if we do this and we go uh, yeah, to the bottom again here and then we go slowly to the top for example i'm just drawing something guys but then the top of the channel would be 85k and that is a number we have been talking about many more times before let's jump quickly into ethereum because i promised it in the intro i need to do what i promise ethereum is doing really good guys it's like around 4k and um, yes 4200 we tripled the previous all-time high so uh, congratulations to ethereum uh, bitcoin did it as well we tripled to 20k to 60k then even went to 65k so yeah maybe ethereum will go also to 5k or something you know increase a little bit more but let's see let's that let's take a rest we had a huge run last week ethereum was a 3k now that's a 4k this is these are huge runs the market needs to calm down and when the market calms down we go sideways like a little bit like this 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 and when we go sideways you know then again i i'm, I'm not saying that this is happening now but then again these patterns start to form you know when you go sideways like this and then when these patterns start to form um, you know you get these triangles or whatever i'm not saying that this is a perfect triangle i'm just saying these kinds of patterns are forming and then at the end of the triangle we break out again and then you break out again mostly with the you know the the height of the start and then it would be like two four thousand four hundred or we break out down and it would be three thousand five hundred so this is what ethereum can uh, be doing at the moment litecoin to the dollar let's see if i can load that chart because i haven't loaded that chart for a day or something ah look litecoin is finding support beautiful on that area of resistance that it broke so litecoin's resistance was this 360,000 at uh, 360,000 that was like beautiful 360 level uh, 360 dollar level was the resistance that was the previous all-time high we broke that one now we came back to retest it and we are around that level of 360 so litecoin is exactly doing i think what it should be doing let's jump into two more very interesting charts bam this one because this is also very interesting i need to check give my face of course my big ass face is on the screen again um let's put it here on the top i never put it on the top now i'm going to put it on the top Let's see how that works out bam so this chart is a very interesting chart guys like you can see uh, woobool.com really who's chart um bitcoin meyer multiple just look at the yellow line and the black line this is the top here in november 2013 then the black line was at 5.9 the meyer multiple they call this line in 2017 at the top somewhere over there the line was at 3.78 now the line is down here at 1.45 the line is at exactly at the level that we were um here there 1.45 that, that was in the 2017 run when bitcoin was at a price of 1400 dollar at that moment bitcoin was 1400 dollar then from that moment 1.5 we went all the way to 3.5 that moment bitcoin was almost 20k so 1.5 to 3.5 was a huge run in bitcoin and now we can see the same pattern again forming here we are at 1.45 so we could be exactly at this level over there you know where we had the peak we came down and that level we start to load up again for another peak another down and then bam so what if we want down we go up again another down and then bam to the level of three that would mean bitcoin would go from this level to easily 100k or something like that which you can also see on bam this chart over here because the nvt price this is the purple line on the bottom is bouncing again from the bottom and every time look when the nvt here in december 2014 uh, sorry december 14 2018 when we bounced from the bottom the price started to increase that's the blue line on top when we bounced from the bottom we saw price increase when we bounce from the bottom over there april 2020 we started to increase when we bounce from the bottom over here 
I expect again that we will increase. Yes, we can go to that one uh, to that level at one more time before that we jump at the one level that you can see here on the left. Sorry, um, but there will be a moment that the MVT will also go up and the price of Bitcoin will be going up in my opinion guys let's take a look at one more chart that will be this one that is the last one BAM yes purple rain purple no that's the prince guys most of my viewers don't even know prince do you know prince yes of course you know prince come on diddy man man you have very intelligent and uh, emotional musicians uh, followers that also know purple rain um, this chart is a really cool chart why is this a really cool chart i'm going to draw why because guys this is the technology adoption curve if we look at that white line that is the global amount of internet users growth so we can see that the amount of internet growth was now like over here we are now at this level there but we started at that level over there and the orange line is the total amount of crypto users so we have over a billion um so so we have over a billion internet users but we are only here with crypto now there at that point and that means that was around 90, 92 to 2006, this area, we are there. In internet, we only kept growing. If we would keep growing with cryptocurrency adoption, the same way we grew with internet, we will come to a point over here where we will have like 2025, where we will have one billion crypto users if we grow less and less so now 50 percent and then 20 percent yearly growth so first 50 percent then 20 percent yearly growth then we will even reach a 2.2 billion amount of crypto users in 2030 this is the crypto this is the end of that time guys so that is a very beautiful chart this is showing you that we are in the beginning of the adoption of cryptocurrency. Even if you miss the complete bull run now, there will be many more bull run cycles all the way up to 2030. 2025 will be again a bull run. 2030 will be again, uh, let's make it beautiful 2030. 2030 will again be a bull run because that is how it works. 2021 is a bull run 2017 was a bull run do you see the jumps do you see the jumps it's four years it's four years it's four oh yeah, yeah i don't move that one did it's four years that is what happening in bitcoin so beautiful chart guys i need to keep it short today because i have some exciting news the exciting news is today um, somebody is arriving here in the house from the Netherlands it's a woman it's a film producer documentary producer music clip producer she's a producer I think she's a producer and anything in television and all that stuff and she's coming here for a week and she's going to live with us for a week film with us for a week and create I think kick-ass content for the Dutch television the week after again probably a French television and the week after that we are also talking now to an English television show like US Great Britain I don't know I, I can't say yet I can't disclose but this week Dutch television so maybe my videos will be not as beautifully timed as always because we are filming a lot as a family but I will try to make some um, um, how do you call this how do you call this back back videos on the back like the making of the documentary videos uh, so that will be really cool and um, I hope you really enjoyed this video if you did enjoy the video then please give the video a thumbs up or two thumbs up share with your friends and family subscribe to the channel please hit the notification bell that you don't miss the BAM videos and leave a comment because I love to respond to your comments that was it for today I'm going to zoom out in Bitcoin and I'm going to zoom in that life and try to enjoy every single minute of the day as that is exactly what life should be about enjoying the view enjoying the palm trees oh yeah and please enjoy the next video today as well because that is a beautiful family video yes about maha who wall it has to do with fishes stingrays ah now I already like wound the whole surprise beautiful video check it later we enjoyed it 
very much. Thanks for watching and see you tomorrow again. Bam!